Hello everybody, welcome back to Deus Ex Mankind Divided. So, last time we were going to do a bunch of point of interest and stuff. And I came back here checking around random places. So these things I can interact with now. I don't remember if I could do that before, but it did, I don't think that I could. Because I would have when I showed you this before. Or is there just those two photos? I don't remember. Either way. So now we can actually examine these photos. Surveillance photos, surveillance photos of me and Vega at Rizika Station. And an ambush site circled near the Rose Garden Cafe. Someone look, looking to take us out of the game. Okay, we can go there. Anything else in the back? No? No little notes? Okay. And a mystery stalker. Ah, sounds interesting. I do like mysteries. We could go there, but up there looks like, huh? Lots of cops. Hmm. And I'm guessing somebody in here. Is it you, Tofu Girl? You? Whatever you want, I can oh, get. Okay. Cheap, high quality. Did I not? Ah, it's that drawer I didn't search. Well, that was eventful. What about you? Most of the people I work with put in 14, 15 hour days. Then they go home and work a little more. That's a nice coat, by the way. Did I read this before? Ah, I did. I shall spare you all from that. That guy was a little weirdly uh, positioned. I told her a thousand hmm. times that man is an idiot. Uh huh. Well. At least you know what you're looking at. Now. Hmm. That was fucking embarrassing. <laughs> God damn it. Alright, let's run back up here. I was like, yeah, I totally got this jump. He'll grab it. He'll he'll grab it. Fucking Jensen! God damn, I really hate the parkour shit in this game sometimes. <clears throat> Fuck! I'm not... <sighs> Fucking... There we go. <sighs> All I wanted to do was jump up here so I could... Jump up here. What? Well, do I even need to? I guess I do have to jump on this at least. Jump up here. There. You. Milo's. Stop right there, Og. No sudden moves. What the fuck? All right, now just take it easy. Say no take sudden moves. Easy. After what you did, all those people you killed. No. No way. You are not leaving until I get answers. Okay, let's talk. No, no, no. Well, who cares? You want answers? You're obstructing an Interpol investigation into the Rizika Station attack officer. Relax and willing to cooperate. So how about not pointing the gun at me? Hmm. I'm gonna reason with him. Relax. I'm willing to cooperate, mm -hmm. so how about not pointing that gun at me? And let you escape? Or attack me? No, the gun is necessary. It will keep you honest. Uh-huh. Fine. What do you want to talk about? I... I saw you there, at the train station, before the bombs went off. Hundreds died because of you. I was there, yeah. But I had nothing to do with the attack. Bullshit! You are trying to confuse me, but you won't. I've been watching you, following you. Good for you. Following me? Yes, I saw you on the street. After they sent me home, I, I recognized you. And what they did, I knew. To make it better, to make it right, I have to stop you. Stop you from killing again. Okay. Listen, I know you're confused. The treasure like this messes with people. So you kill me and what? Become some kind of hero? The only person who needs to be stopped here is the one waving the, his gun around. I kind of feel like this, but I'm not going to attack him. 
I don't think we can reason with him, though. And turning the tables is just going to make him more defensive or aggressive. We only got to reason with him and hope. Listen, I know you're confused. A tragedy like that... Yeah. ...messes with people. You seem okay. Me. This tragedy, like you said, messes with people. But you seem fine. Makes a person wonder. Hold it. I see now. I know what I must do. <sighs> Killing me won't bring the dead back to life. It just doesn't work that way. I know that. But it could save someone else. Yes. It would make sure you never kill again. No, no, it won't. I'm sorry. Dude, that's a cool helmet, too. Like when he put the visor on, that was pretty cool. Sorry, guy. But uh, it had to be done. Oh, good ebook. Let's see. The Tsar Republic enters the 21st century. In the decades that followed the so called Velvet Revolution of 1989 and the break of the Communist rule, the Tsar Republic embraced the capitalist democratic way of life more successfully than any other country from the former Soviet Union. In the first decade of the 21st century, the Republic was taking in its steps on the road toward full developed status and true socio-economic growth. By 2004, this progressive, large, secular, and forward-looking country had become a member of the European Union and their role in the European common market was steadily growing. Their future seemed bright. All that was lacking was someone with the vision and boldness to take the next step. That someone was Zofia Rizika. Interesting. And now we have Rizika Station named after them. That's pretty cool. I like that. I wonder if that's a real... I wonder if this is a real place named after that real thing. That'd be pretty cool. 2004. Not too far off, but not too recent, so it's that means possible. Hmm. We have plenty of other um, points of interest. Kind of sad we couldn't reason with him further, but a guy like that, I don't think we can. Oh right, good cop, bad cop. Oh right. Yeah, that's gonna suck. There's a lot of stuff to deal with good cop, bad cop. Oof, do I care enough about it? I'd rather kind of do Vince's apartment, to be quite honest. Yeah, I'll just get it to when we get to Vince's apartment. Oh, Vince's apartment's above the drugstore? Is it? No, it's by the red light district. Oh, okay, good. I was like, hmm, oh. Oh. Huh. I see some scrap metal I didn't pick up before. How poor of me. Anything else? Eh, it does look like it. So, Vince. Oh, that was not there before. Vincent! My bud, my pal, my friend! This wasn't here before. Delara, I found Vince. Oh. You were right to have a bad feeling. What are you saying, Adam? Is he... Yeah. <sighs> he should have been pulled months ago. It's all over his profile. Vince lost his edge. A person tries to be two things at once, sometimes he ends up not being either of them. He becomes lost. I'll take your word for it. Oh. I'm gonna let you be the one to break this to Miller. Right. Of course. Be careful out there, Adam. Well, it looks like they knew he was a fucking rat. A stiletto. Hmm. Vince Black was a double agent tangled up in a double life. I don't know exactly what got him killed or why, but I'm starting to think I never will. Was there- did she kill him? Did she? I didn't think she did. 
Well, I guess we'll find out hopefully with this at least. That was not here last time though, and that was not what I wanted. Oh, well, we can just read it up here. Goodbye, Vince. From a main to Shaznabog. Shaznabog? So Vince Black is Shaznabog. Oh, that makes sense. That's interesting. Shaznabog is Vincent Black. How long did you expect to live two lives without me finding out? And did think you might have kept fooling us if... Had you not told her. She's very good, isn't she? Knows how to make a man feel safe, loved, even... By the time you're reading this, Vlasta will have holding a gun to your face. I asked him to give you something before pulling the trigger. So he said it was your favorite. Oh. Oh. Fuck. We got duped. Well, I got duped. Oh, damn. I... I cannot believe that. Damn. She she fooled him good and she fooled me good. That looks really nice. Is that the bridge that we saw before? That looks really nice. Like really nice. Yeah, that's the bridge. That's cool. Okay. Now where do we need to go? Good cop, bad cop probably. Yeah, good cop, bad cop. I'm not gonna enjoy this. This place is gonna suck. Cause uh, there's a lot of bad guys there. There's a lot of me. I've already went through and snuck and done some of the knocking out and uh, other fifth faff that is not so fun. But uh, yeah, it's uh, it's gonna suck. Oh, yeah. It's like on a whole another part of the city that's sectioned off. That is going to be a pain. Unless it's something else I'm thinking of. Man, I'm liking all these cars I get to deactivate. That's nice. Is there a... Ah, I know where I need to go. Okay. Right here. Okay. They moved it. Um... Sh shit? Oh, I can climb on a tree. Good. Okay. Alright. Well, this was more eventful than I thought. And this is that... Yeah, the dead guy. Okay. Yeah. Did you have a name? You're just civilian. Right. Anything new? No? Nope. Okay. Well, that's awkward. Anything new in here? Uh, TV I can hack. That's about it. Information archive. Oh, I thought that was actually something special. Um, and just a newspaper from Summons Dots. Stuff we've already read. Okay. Nothing special. Well, rest in peace, buddy. I'm sorry. So, if that's not good cop, bad cop, where the fuck was I before? Huh. There's a whole nother place I was and I'm, I am completely mistaken. I've just, I just wandered off and was beating up like innocent gangbangers and stuff. The fuck? Man, I gotta really reevaluate my moral code. I mean, those gangbangers, they weren't a side quest at all. They were just innocent XB. I was beating the shit out of him for no reason. I really, I really gotta think about things before I, I do them. Sorry for that little jump cut. I have sneezed something fierce. I don't even have time to meet myself. That's the worst. Uh. So, uh, Smiley. I really feel like I gotta go beat up those gangbangers, but I don't remember if I can actually find my way to them. They were like, I think they were here. I think this is where they are. No, they weren't. They were here. This is where they were. No, they weren't. Where are they? It is the theater. I think they were at the theater. Yeah. 
I think we came I came out like here yeah okay so that's where I was beating up innocent gangbangers okay all right I feel less confused and more relieved I should have stayed in bed thank you so much for complimenting my coat good luck finding it makes me feel so much better oh she noticed my nice coat and I can't stand up against any of these walls to show it off. That's awkward. Wait. Nope. 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 Well. Whatever. I got a nice coat. She complimented it. And I feel great. That's all that matters. And we get to see uh, Aria and Smiley. Thank you. So, Arya, any more cops hey, get beat up? Out of chance? I heard about Rucker. That's terrible, Adam. He was our standard bearer. I think we've done this already. I don't know. Oh, I spoke God. to Miller as he was leaving. Yeah, I'm I hope sorry. He has better luck. Yeah, I'd we already not. did this. I'm pretty yeah, sure. Fubar is what'll happen. Okay. Ooh, test results. How did it go with Dr. Rosette? She ran some tests? I swear to God, Adam. These tests they give me are more stressful than being in the field. When I'm out there, I have immediate feedback every second. I feel when like doing these tests, they just stare at you and take notes. Mm. I don't like it. Nobody does. When do you get the results? Uh, we... Dr. Ozen didn't say. I don't know, hopefully in a day or two. Try and stay positive. Always. Mm. I feel like we've already talked to her about this. Yeah, it's just gonna repeat. Going. Okay. Talk also, who is that handsome gentleman up in the top left? Can I see you from here? Who are you? Because it zoomed in on you really closely. Who are you? Looks kind of like Seraph. No, it's not Seraph. Who are you? That's not Rucker, is it? Is that Rucker before the... That is Rucker before the... Um, before he became part of Ark. Okay. She's not in here. What? Oh. My dear, you don't have a. Uh, you know my door is icon. always Actually, open. Hold on. Don't oh, mind me, I'm just sitting in your lap. Okay, I've already read those. Never mind. So, what's up? Well, I... extend me the same professional courtesy then. Okay, I'll just. Um, I'll, uh... I hope you find something in Black's office that you can use. Uh, he's dead. So. You know. No. We should find out, Ooh. but it's not a priority. I can hack this. I'll just do this real quick. Access granted. Ooh. All right. Yeah, we've seen it already. Let's see. Simon Daniels to Pedro. Hey, what's a check word for self do you know anything about Lieutenant Whitaker? Probably some. Who works for Tarbos. I was just on the phone with him, and when I asked him if he had any recent problem with augmented agitators, he got quiet and invasive. Is it possible he's in someone's pocket? Probably some nut. I looked into him pretty thoroughly around a month back. There's something off about him, but he's not on the take. I'm sure of that. And uh, it's Whitaker, yeah, by the way. With an... Okay. Uh, from Simon Daniels, Daniel Fetcher, subject two more. I got two more potential IDs That's for you. Gotta raise my Martha and Lucas Bibkels, locals, mother and son. They may have trouble making the IDs because their papers are fairly recent, issued by a battered out, woman organization. Oh, Lucas! You just know some the... head of law enforcement. Okay, we've, we've been to their place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we've seen it already. Simon's positive ID on the mother of Martha. We're certain Lucas is not one of our deceased, so he's in the wind somewhere. Extensive bruises on her hand, shoulders, and back suggest the died. We should find out. Shielding her son from the collapsing debris. Thanks, Simon. I'm sure we can do. We could have made this one without your tip. We couldn't have made this one. No, we could have made this one without your tip. Probably some no. Huh. Smiley, you're a piece of shit. Let's go talk to you. I wonder if uh, Lucas was that kid in the cutscene who had his mom die. That would be fucked up. It's very possible. Daniel, did you fucking do that? Did you do that? 
I didn't notice that before. God damn you. What's up? Daniel Fletcher. You are a genius. Yeah, uh, let's talk. Smiley. Oh, hey. Adam, what's going on? Miller sent me to... Checking my progress? Really? I said it would be done when it's done. You can't rush these things, Adam. Excellence takes time. Right. So... Well, I was right. Am I good or am I good? What did you find? Oh, just some isolated fragments from what looks like Bomb's timing mechanism. And get this. It's a Stanek. Stanek? The Bomb's timing mechanism was a wristwatch? Well, to address your incredulous tone, a mechanical timing mechanism is not as silly as it sounds. Security scanners can detect anything with a suspicious electronic circuit, so... Using a low-tech solution is really clever. Stanic watches are custom-made locally. I think I'll pay the shop a visit. Hmm, it's probably closed. Let's see if I can find you a second option. Yeah, got it. Nomad Stanic, founder and owner of the store, lives in the Davnia Vod district near Pilgrim Station. That's Putnik Nadraji in Czech, I, I think. Building number 96, second floor. Nice, I'll check it out. Great, let me know how it goes. Okay, that's cool. A lot more eventful than I actually expected. You got anything else for me? I'll look into Stanek's records, see if there's anything okay. to me. Okay. Call me if you find something. Anything new in here? Actually, anything new on your laptop? Never mind any emails that aren't... Hey, Jensen, what do you know? Hey, Smiley, what's up? Bye. Okay. Hmm. I don't think there's going to be anything else too interesting in here. I guess we could talk to... Man, all these computers are available now, even though they're here. I gotta. Real quick, I'm gonna hack both. Access granted. Alright, got both. So let's see, from Mary White to Aiden Green. Aiden, I've been Why looking at satellite photos to try and suss Never where the mind. Dubai the helicopter came from. But the crazy weather patterns made... Excuse me! I didn't even know they could do that. That's fucking scary. Everything go haywire. Do you have any good uh, overviews of Sudai? Thanks, Mary. That just... From Aiden to Hans Gerber. Right Dubai. What's a senseless clusterfuck? Your CT, maybe you can tell me what the hell were we even doing there? Is it supposed to be the Oman's office jurisdiction, isn't it? It's going to bug me until I know. I asked Mac the same thing. He gave me his insubordination look and told me to drop it. I think you should too, for your own good. Interesting. From Jean, Cloth Jean Guy Cloth Ear to Aiden Green. I've been looking through everyone's latest passwords and there was... There are some people with passcodes that make me despair even in a place like this. The guy any IT could tell you would scare anyone in security shitless. No wonder Chang looks like he's having an embolism every time I pass him on the floor. For example, one of our personal computers in this place actually uses the password Neuropazin. Now, where might that be? Wait. You correctly guessed the infirmary. Holy shit, Aiden, you're a genius. Maybe I should warn one of the doctors to change it before Chang shoots himself. Okay, that was pretty good. And this one. Excuse me. Don't shove your fingers in my face, because it's... From Simon Daniels to Ellen Aleski Murphy. This is only a preliminary heads up. I'm working to confirm it. I'm convinced Rucker's smuggling Neuropazin and other things into Golem City. The Germans never shut down his old operation, he just moved it. It would explain why Ark is so willing to use violence to keep the police out of their territory. And from Aleski Murphy to Debbie Connolly, bombing tape. Debbie, I'm trying to analyze the footage on the train station bombing, but the records we got from the state police is corrupt. I thought you said they were they had a good master. They can't keep dicking us around like this. We're supposed to be on the same side. People are dead, Aleski. They're dead. 
Oleski, I have just been on the phone with them for every or for over an hour. They insist they had a clear master and they gave us what they had. They're going to look into it. They sound as confused and angry as we are. Believe them this time, Debbie. Interesting. Interesting. So that was the infirmary password that I've already hacked into. I didn't hack into this one though. Hmm. Let me hack into this one real quick. Granted. All right. And then I have to hack another one. What was that sound? I'm not taking that. I'm not taking that. I'll take that. That doesn't hurt anybody if I take a bio cell. There's that. Huh. I don't care too- well, let's see. Nothing there, okay. That's a weird sound. Oh, this is a weird one too. Alright. That wasn't too bad. Now, what's in the box? A triangle code. I don't really need all that neuropathy, so I'm gonna just leave it. I mean, it doesn't really make a difference if I take it or not. I've got too much of it, honestly. Oh, right, I forgot. So apparently, these um, gyroscopic uh, regulators and the stem processor chips and the... Um, the hydraulic micro pumps, I can sell those to Tech Noir Guy for like twice the value, supposedly. Or not twice the value, that's essentially more money. Needed. And that's about it. That's all. Something strange Anything? is no. going on here. Okay. So there's that. Is there a reason for that? How do I. How does one. Ah. No? Hmm. How do you... Um... Oh. <laughs> oh, I over fucking thought that way too damn much. That's... Uh, that's relieving. Oh. Jeez. How is there some sort of secret <clears throat> passage or maybe a secret button? I don't. Oh, I just walk around the corner. Lights. Very, very easy mistake. God damn it. So, how is all your day? I hope it's going well. I'm playing Day Sex. That's pretty cool. We're gonna hopefully get some more answers. Probably not though. Probably not. Just more side quests. Let's let's be real. We just play Deus Ex to lay back, relax, and enjoy ourselves. Was it always that bumpy? Um. Okay, you're not dead. That's new. I don't want any trouble. Good luck finding the people who hacked us. Um. Interesting. Madam Photograph to the Watcher. File request. Hey, the visitor's coming back to Prague. Hold the fucking phone. He needs updated files on the subject whenever you can get it. In recent, he is insistent. Sorry for the short notice. You know how he is. He'll pick up the file in the storage unit. FYI, it's just recorded it. It's 5053. Leave me a message if there are any trouble. Good luck. Hopefully, it are you the Watcher? Yo. Nice talking to you, Jensen. For a change. Nice ass. Is she the fucking watcher? Is she? Make what the, the fuck? Dude, not cool. I just 
had some revolutionary shit and then you fucking almost make me shit my pants. I was not ready for that. What the fuck? No, not the clock tower place. Nobody's gonna come to this shit? Dude. Oh. That special. shop is closed. I can see that. What happened? Yeah. It must have upset someone. Ogs, Devouri, who knows? But uh, buildings don't just spontaneously erupt into flames. There's always a reason. I mean, sometimes they spontaneously I'm erupt. I'm sure you are. So, uh, is this official? I knew the old man's past would finally catch up with you. Who are you with? Local? National? Um... Mm... I guess focused. I just want to ask him a few questions. Oh, sure you do. Sure you do. Just picking an old clockmaker's brain, right? You found the watch and you want to know what it's worth. Let me guess. That was it's his shop. Hobby, right? Oh shit. Right. Anyway, oh. you won't find him in that ruin. He must have fallen behind on his payments. Well, that's good for him. Um did you see what happened though? Did you see what happened to the shop? I see everything. Uh-huh. And what happened? This little accident is clearly a message to Nomad. When you borrow money, pay it back. The Valleys. Was he having money problems? Okay. If you're borrowing money from the Valley, you have money problems. Okay, that answer is a good bit. You said something about his past finally catching up with him. Playing dumb, hmm? As if you don't already know all of this. Dude. The demonstrations, the sabotage. They used to call it activism. Now they call it Terror. Actually, that's very true. What was he protesting? Everything. Anti-globalization, the oil industry, boycotts, sit-ins. A real agitator. Yeah, that's what they call them nowadays, too. Agitators. Any idea where I can find him? Oh, well. Prague's a big city. Might be anywhere. Guy could spend days searching if he didn't have a solid lead. And guy yeah, could go I hungry if he didn't going. give me a solid lead. Listen. I'm providing a service here. It's only right I get compensated. You know what I mean? Um. Uh, oh, but persuading gives me XP. This is important, sir. I I'm need to curious. find Stanic before something bad happens. Are you threatening me? You can't go around threatening people just because I'm an influential guy around here. I know a lot of sensitive information. I can tell. Someone like you knows everything that happens in this area, don't you? Fingers on the pulse of the city, right? I don't have time to waste with you. And maybe you shouldn't walk the streets alone at night. Anything can happen out here. Imagine the loss of the community. Now, I think he's an Alpha so far. I can tell. Two out of three. Someone like you knows everything that happens in the area, don't they? Fingers on the pulse of the city, right? Exactly. People need to know. They come to me. And okay. they treat me with the respect I deserve. Know what I mean? Yes, yes. Well, I need your help. Couldn't do it without you. I can't go into details, but you'd be doing a huge service to the city. Maybe even the world. The world, huh? I knew it! No, I'd hit on something eventually. Stanex hold up oh, in a yeah. small bar in the red light district across the street from the Red Queen. Across, okay. The red Queen, got it. Across the street from the Red Queen. Smiley, Stanek's shop was torched. Dead end? No. I spoke to a local who says that Stanek went to a hmm. bar in the red light district across from the Red Queen. I'm heading there now. We have a couple of agents in that district watching the Diwali now. I'll send them over. Copy that. Okay. Let me sell stuff in real quick. That's all the stuff I needed to sell. But I do need to move something because it will cause my OCD to freak out. Yes. 
There we go. Everything else, don't care about. Yep. I still can't believe that, though. Oh, it does say Stansky. Oh, Stanek. Um, and that's really it. I got a Praxis. It would be wasteful if I didn't get this, like, as quick as possible. Does that mean I could just get that? That's really it. Yeah. Hmm. I have a feeling like we're gonna go to that place I accidentally stumbled upon. Hmm. Also, I'm I'm fucking not liking the her possibly being the watcher. Man, don't don't mess with my trust issues. After you compliment my coat. No. No. I like that. And then you might be betraying me. What is this? Are you special? One, two, three, oh. 420 FL floor two. 420. Is there apartment areas? 420. Yeah, see, this is all. Yeah, that's where I was before. Okay. Oh, yeah, and there's that. Um. 420. Floor two. Hmm. I, I can't figure it out. Maybe apartments? Fourth. No, no. It wouldn't make any sense. Mm. Excuse me. Game. Can you please? I never noticed that. That's real nice. Where is that coming from? Oh, from there. That's pretty nice. I know it's probably supposed to be a girl, you know. But I like that larger than life type thing. Ah, over there. I haven't been there yet. Interesting. Yep, she's still there. Hmm. Yeah, we can't go over there. Hello. Any news? Gossip? Welcome to the Irish stool, buddy. Rumors? Pull one up and I will see what we can do for you. Ooh. Irish stool. Catchy name. Very evocative. I like to think so. Well, what will it be? Um. Ooh. Marmor Pil Plishner? Chenchug Pale Ale or Beekman's Brown Ale? Mm. Ales are alright. This is interesting. But no, drinks right now, don't thanks. do anything for Got me. Something to get to. Sorry. Love a good drink though. So. Have you seen a bachelorette party around here? I got distracted by. Well, you know. Ma. It's understandable. They're nice looking men. Mm -hmm. Anything else? No? Anything behind the bar? Hello. Now that's interesting. Well. Hey, I'm a shit. This I know! And I know you're gonna sit there quietly and wait with us like a good little watchmaker. I've got this, Major Riley. You and your partner can relax for a few minutes. Wait a minute. I know you. You've been in my shop. What is this? You have some things to answer for, Mr. Stanek. We have evidence linking you and your shop to the train station bombing. Bombing? No! I would never... I, I wouldn't even know where to start. Y you have the wrong man. I, I... I don't have a staff. It's only a, a small shop. You know that. It, it's Jensen, right? Your name? It is. Think, Mr. Stanek. Is there anyone else who had access to your shop? There's only myself and my... Your daughter? No. No. Look, take me in. I'm the one you're looking for, not her. I... I have made bombs for them. 
I don't think so. Protecting your daughter is admirable, Mr. Stanek. But you're not doing her any good by taking the blame. You need to tell me what you know. I... You're right, I know. Allison was in the military. She always wanted to belong, to be part of something greater than herself. She was such a beautiful child. Gifted. What happened? After the incident, she met some people. They said they were her friends, but I could see they only wanted to use her. Parasites, and, and now, now, they have taken her. You must help. She is not to blame for this. She has been coerced. Calm down. What do you mean they've taken her? Allison and I were supposed to meet here tonight. Instead, one of them came by, spewing curses about fleshers and naturals. He gave me a message from her. She was... She was saying goodbye. But she would never... They used her, and now they intend to make her disappear. Interesting. It's a very sad situation, but I don't think your daughter's been... coerced. Um, tell me about the shop you owned. Your shop was firebombed. People in the area think it may have been the Diwali. Did they ask you for protection money? Dredic? Nikoladze? No. I make him watches for a discount. A discount? Really? I was never a wealthy man, but my shop was well known and respected. After what happened to Allison, Dredic knew I needed all the money I had. Really? So you worked out a different arrangement. So why would the Diwali firebomb your store? Dredic is a man of business. If someone makes him a better offer, friendship means nothing to a thug. Hmm. Interesting. About her friends now. What do you know about these friends of hers? Other than they were augmented? Not much. They only spoke to Allison when they came to the shop. As if anyone unaugmented was beneath them. Kept talking about the ascension, whatever that is. Okay, machine god cult, probably. Alright, interesting. Does your daughter have the expertise to do this? Much more than I do. She was in the military. EOD, Ooh. they called it. Explosive Ordnance Disposal. Um, the yeah. Yes. She was happy in the military. They augmented her, rebuilt her to make her better at what she did. But after the incident, she was dishonorably discharged. Mm. She was lost. That's when these new friends found her. Ugh. They exploited her, and now they plan to discard her. Mm. I'll try to help your daughter, Mr. Stanek. Where can I find Allison, Mr. Stanek? I wish I knew. I would go and get her away from those people. I was about to go looking for her when your goon showed up. We'll find her. I need you to go with these agents. I'll have some more questions for you. No! I have to go! I have to help her! She's... She's all I have! Please, let us do our job. Oh, Jensen, that's so Find cold. my daughter, or I will! Jensen, that's so cold. Don't... Breaking my balls. Smiley, I spoke to Stanek. He's not our guy, but he has a daughter. Allison. Ex-military, EOD. She might be the bomb maker. So what's our next move? Stanek says he doesn't know where she is, but I think he's hiding something. That? The agents are bringing him in. Until he gives her up, I this like investigation that. is stalled. I'll make sure they lean on him. See right? what he knows. Good. Let me know what happens. Did I see Nomad Stanek getting caught? Yeah. Janice heard the NSN conversation we recovered. He agrees you two should meet. Good. Just tell me where. There's an abandoned tourist information center in the central plaza. Make sure you're not followed. And I got something on Marchenko for you, too. Details are on a pocket secretary near the meetup point. Look for a trash bin with a chalk mark above it. You'll find it near the metro. Got it. Most interesting. Most interesting indeed. Is there anything I can get you? You mentioned a whiskey. I shall take that. Enjoy. If we get Is some answers, we'll celebrate. Nah, that'll be all.
I've got everything I need. Everyone should be so lucky. As it would seem. What can I get you? Well. See ya. Man, we got more answers than I expected. Whiskey, am I, right? I really expect this episode to just be filler quests, but no, they all went quickly and then we got some real answers and we got some real plot and story. Some real plots. And uh Man, now things are turning up Jensen. It's nice. Now more side quest stuff. Yeah. How far? Not too far. That's not too bad. Not much going on. Ooh, should we do this and then end the episode? Maybe. We'll see how long this takes. I don't want us to get too deep into stuff without uh being able to finish up. I'm really scared about just other bombs going off now. Mm. Get out of my way. Trash bin, shock. Probably, oh, you know what? It's probably that over. Oh, no, it's not there. Different place I was thinking of. Hmm. Um. Downstairs, maybe? No, it wouldn't be downstairs. Right over here, maybe? Hmm. You know what? Why am I even worrying about it? I should just do that. Hmm. Ah, there we go. Dude, that's so subtle. That is so subtle. Thank you, though. Survey? No, it's not gonna. There we go. Thank you. Okay. From Anon 67 to Anon 74. Victor Marchenko, born in 1991 near Zaporoskiga, Ukraine. Parents were illiterate railway workers. Left school after 10 years, two years shy of the compulsory 12, to become a shift worker on a drilling gang looking for a shale gas deposit in eastern Ukraine. Ran in trouble into 2011 when a group of pro Russian separatists started a fight with his crew in Maripol. After work, he tried to break it up, got injured, and ended up in hospital. Could have been when he got augmented, not sure. Records get pretty scarce here. In fact, he's a good 12 year period where he can't account for. And no records when he or where he did get augmented. Shows up again briefly in 2023, this time with a wife and newborn kid, Alyssa Martinov and Reyes Vic Viktronika. Only now he's in Belgorod. Which I don't get, frankly. A pro Ukrainian national moving to Russia only makes sense if he stayed the energy companies all those years. Everyone wanted a piece of everyone wanted a piece of the reserves after 2015, but that would have put him somewhere in Siberia, not Bulgarod. Bulgarod is on the border with Ukraine. It's got nothing to do with the oil. It does, however, have a long history of military occupation. And in 2016, it was the city in which the newly minted Russian Federation states deployed Bell Tower Associates to quell Ukrainian anti-separatist dissension once and for all. So why have a kid there until there in 2023? Still working on finding that one out and finding out what happened to the wife and new kid afterward. Because neither of them were with him when he immigrated to the Udilic complex last year. Maybe he switched energy companies from oil to fucking solar power or whatever or something. Or, yeah, he did go with military. This place! I wanted to investigate this place! Because I didn't get to investigate it before because there was these thingies. That I couldn't, like, mess with. Okay, cool. I actually have to go here. Well, I guess it's better than we didn't investigate it earlier as well. Oh, we got a little bit of time. I gotta cut stuff out anyway, so. Including this hacking. Initial access granted. Whatever. Fuck that shit. Alright. 
Wasted a couple, wasted a stop on that. Got nothing out of it. Got breach software. I guess that counts. Ah, hmm. oh, not fun. All right, and we got an ebook and some pain pills. This is it. This looks like that uh, registration office before. Hmm. Rosika's augmented platform crumbles. Mass pr privatization soon led to an economic boom, which in turn led to subsequent tax breaks for the augmented workers needed to help build the new infrastructures. There were a few voices of dissent. Occasionally, non-augmented citizens accused the government of catering to corporate interests over the national ones and attempted to demonstrate against the fast trace tracking of Vista, no, visas and work permits from for foreign augmented workers, but for the most part, the Chez Republic embraced the reform wholeheartedly, so much that with the mid-2020s, Prague had a moderate population of augs that had become a hub for the many immigrated workers traveling through the EU nations and Eastern Europe. No one could have predicted what would happen in 2027 with so many resident augmented workers. The Aux incident struck the Republic particularly hard. Rizika herself was one of the victims in this tragic uh, tragic event. When the President's augmented bodyguard lost control and crushed her li crashed her limousine into the waters of Vlatava River where they both drowned. 2027, so that would make Vic about 35? 9 plus 27. No, he'd be like 36. Okay. So how do we... How do I get down? Oh. There's a vent. There's a vent for that. Yep. Alright. So are those things arms? I look down and I see quite a few of those. I see you guys maybe in here with me? Can't tell. Hmm. Not sure. Can I jump up all the way up there? Oh, I can. Oh, and it's irrelevant. Unless I could open this, but I can't. So, whatevs. Alright. We'll explore a wee bit. So I see those. They look like... Well, satchel charges. Like, this place is ready to blow, but... I mean... You know. Hello. Ooh. Do I want to end the episode early? I think I gotta end the episode. Ooh. Oh. Information is crazy. Huh. Okay. Oh, with, oh, with, oh, okay. Oh, alright. In the next episode, we'll go and deal with that. Because I feel like this is gonna take a while. So, yeah. I hope you guys are enjoying this episode. Enjoy the series. Or I hope you guys do find something to enjoy today, because I'm going to enjoy going over there and probably dealing with, uh, Giannis, yeah? Yeah, we'll see. Alright, anyway, I will see you guys later. Bye bye